Hey everyone, here we have a vintage Kisco Flora Fan, model 7000R20, serial number 366751, 150 watts, it features a Redmond motor, model 6102, counterclockwise rotation, 1500 RPM, 2 amps, 130 watts, 1 20th of a horsepower, and the motor serial is 4033479. It used to be three speed, but the speed switch is missing, so the power cord wires directly to the motor. This was an eBay find. As you can see, it's in kind of rough condition, it needs a repaint. Now, the fact that it's three speeds, but the motor only has the power cord for one, probably means it used like a choke coil for speed control. So I can either leave it as is or get like a modern speed control or something to install on it. I haven't powered it up yet because first thing I had to do was I had to put a new cord on it because I'll show you the old one here if you can see. It's exposed conductors. This cord is very brittle. All I gotta do is bend it and see it's copper exposed already. It's like there's no way I'm running this thing with this cord. So, new cord, new plug. I gave it some oil with Zoom Spout. Let's see what happens here. It's either going to run or it's going to blow up. Let's see. It runs. It moves a lot of air. Shot of the underside with the motor. Look at that! Look at the size of that motor. Let's see if I can get you to see this. Or not. There it goes. If you can read that or not, pause it to read. Russell, Michigan, made in USA. My little wiring connection there because like I said this red this is the power coming in going to the motor and the power cord connected directly to that so there's no speed switch on here at all when I got it so the fact that it says three speeds but the motor is technically one probably use like some kind of speed control or choke coil to limit the voltage going to it so if I have to see about finding like a three speed uh, speed control or solid state or something either modern or vintage and maybe make it three speed again, or I can just leave it as one. But it does run. It moves a lot of air, though. So a fresh coat of paint, and she should be good to go. So, thanks for watching.